Hi, I'm David Klein. I'm an orthopedic surgeon at Kennedy White Orthopedics in Sarasota, Florida. In this orthopedic moment, I wanted to talk about basal joint arthritis. The basal joint, which is literally the base of the thumb, is the joint that provides the circular motion that allows the thumb to move to all of the digits. This is called opposition. Basal joint arthritis is the second most common genetic condition that involves arthritis of the hand. Typically, you will see people that get it start to develop a prominence on the side of their thumb, and sometimes it even looks as if the thumb is moving into the hand where it can become stiff and not function well. People complain of pain on their dominant side when twisting keys, opening bottles, any type of pinching, and any type of manipulations using the thumb. Similar problems occur with the non-dominant side, except for turning keys, which people rarely do with their non-dominant hand. Basal joint arthritis sometimes is sharp, sometimes is aching, but rarely causes any numbness or tingling. Typically, the pain is either at the base of the thumb or sometimes into the muscles at the base of the thumb. Basal joint arthritis is not the only cause for pain at this location, but it's certainly one of the more prominent causes, especially as people are in their 40s, their 50s, and sometimes older. The first thing to do if you start to get problems like this is to start modifying your activities and trying to avoid the hand position that's causing the problem. Commonly, you can make basal joint arthritis feel less painful if you grasp things with a bent thumb instead of with a straight thumb. Another thing would be to try an over-the-counter splint for the thumb that you can get from a store that wraps around the hand. You can find these in drug stores and other stores. There are also over-the-counter topical medications such as topical Voltaren that can be applied to the thumb at the base of the thumb. This may or may not be helpful. If you have further problems, see an orthopedic surgeon. Sometimes a cortisone injection will be helpful. There are other treatments that can be helpful and surgery can be done for people who do not respond to non-operative treatments. Thanks for listening to this talk about basal joint arthritis. Thank you for listening to this orthopedic moment.